Hi folks, Mr. Tessalonian here. What you're looking at in front of you is an invention I've been working on called Hydro Skates. They're basically a hydrofoil water skate instead of an ice skate or roller blade system. But with this design, you're going to take much longer strides with your steps, more like a stair stepper style action with it. And as you do so, you're going to gain not only lift up out of the water, but forward momentum at the same time. Now I've showed you some other videos where I show you how a hydrofoil can do this. Right now all I want to do is just push it down and show you that we gain a forward momentum by just pushing it down. See it takes off forward, I pull it up, it's going to go even further forward. So here's a quick shot, push it down, pull it up. You see how far across the screen it moved with two simple actions. Let's go ahead once again, push it down, pull it up, push it down. On these designs here, what I have is basically individual skates for each one of your feet with a hydrofoil at the bottom of them. A place to actually mount your feet to them, where you have velcro straps to go around your ankle, a bridge strap here to go around the bridge of your foot, a nice padded area here to put your foot in there. Down at the bottom of the rods, I have some stabilizer arms and then a nice hydrofoil there. And the hydrofoil is designed to flip vertical just like this and then return to a horizontal position with about a three degree up angle to it, which is a good hydrofoil angle. And what that's going to do is this. So when you're down in the water, when you take your first step up, so you're going to pull your leg up, what's going to happen is the resistance of the water against the back edge of that hydrofoil is going to fold the hydrofoil just like this, vertical, as you step up, giving very little resistance. Now when you get to the top of your stroke, you're going to go step down again, and that's when the hydrofoil turns back horizontal again, giving you resistance that will not only gain the height that you just put into it with your step, but also now from that height that you're going to gain forward momentum, as you start to go back down into the water, giving you both lift and forward momentum at the same time. So as you step with these hydrofoil water skates, you're going to start gaining speed and you're going to start coming up out of the water as you do so, which will give you basically the feeling like you're skating on water. Now this design, the foils were just a little too small to get me fully up to speed. I was able to get going, I was able to gain forward momentum and lift, but I wasn't able to break the overall resistance of my body against the water with the speed I was gaining from them to be able to get fully up out of the water. So before I tear these apart, I wanted to show you the original idea. So now what I'm going to do to change this, to make it so it'll function, is I'm going to add one more foil to each one of the skates. So instead of having a single foil on each one of them, I'm now going to have twin foils. I'm going to put one out in front, one in the back there behind it, space that out a little bit. You don't want the foils too long because the resistance at the end of the foil really bends against your ankle up here on the rod, so it's hard to control. And you don't want them too wide because then the flip over time is too long. You lose most of your energy between the up and down cycle when you try to step. So keeping a narrow foil about that long is what I'm going to need to do. Now I just need to double that up. So I'm going to add one more foil to each one of these about that size. And when the water finally stops freezing at night, we'll bring these out 